Today's game is coming live from still burning Los Scandalous Crazy Donia, where the Porsches are all paid for. Everyone's big break is still coming, and the starlets say, Don't worry, baby, it's only a cold sore. And this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Lost Wages Invaders battle. The Lost Scandalous Bolts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Are you ready for some MFL action? Am I? I love MILFs! Newtons I'd like to fuck! He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you half-wit. Oh! I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime MILF lingerie girls team! What a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all! Oh, oh. va 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 boom And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. Wrestles away from that side. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Man, what a hit that was. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Second down the size of Brick's wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Hot two, hot, hot. He is fighting for every yard. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. Eight. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. We should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one time thing. First and ten. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one.
And it's first and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps outside. And in some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, yeah. they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. And it's first and ten. Second down and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Second and eight to go. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Eight. And the defense just knocked the wind out of that quarterback. Second down in a mile. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Third down and the punter is warming up. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. First and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two. Two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Now, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. It's 
First and ten. in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. First down. And it's first and ten. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. is important. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Not much there. Maybe a yard. Second down and nine. He's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 The nasty dirty trick in the NFL is Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> 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 Last year, Grim. <laughs> yeah, she said for 20 bucks, I'll take it all off. I didn't know she met her head. That was uh, kind of weird. <laughs> well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. He's not going down. First and ten. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. And that is caught. 
out for a first down. And it's first and ten. Uh, come on, man. You got to catch that. I don't catch it. There's a bloody red head on the field. Now that's their red penalty marker, Bricks. Looks like this one's coming back. First down and seven. QB passes it for maybe a yard. They've got to open up the offense here, Bricks. Second down and six. Chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Mm. It's good. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring.
They stop the clock with their first timeout, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work breaks. Defense holds them to a four-yard pickup there. Well, that's two timeouts burned, and you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Well, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that constant relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling them, time out. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's warming down his guy to the speed feed grip. He's running from his team. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandkids. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. It might make more sense to punt here than attempt a field goal. This is way too long. Straight through the uprights. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Mom Satan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where are we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, I'm going to go to a strippee show. Where are we going? Yeah, I got hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. Looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. the sticks moving he picks up five yards on that play second down and five that my friends was an all 
Pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. Catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Oh, man, what a throw. And it was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. You think a robot would do the electric slide, wouldn't you, Graham? It's in their programming to reject that particular move, Bricks. Two on the nose. That and, uh, well, the robot. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? The kick is good! Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Was it a catch? And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. First down and long. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down and six. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. And the defense goes for the juggle. If this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Rick? Psycho killer! First and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's 
first and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. And he runs it for four yards. Third down and six. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. Your point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hey. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Hot one, hey. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. First and ten. Hot one. Hot. Oh, with the punishing hit. Second down and five. Hot, hot one. into the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed... They might consider calling a kill the ref play. Just saying. <laughs> Second down and a lot. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. That's a little on the nose, don't you think? If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh, he just got crushed.
Fourth down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they... He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite, Dave, because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Third down and eight. Hot one, hot two, hot First down, so now they have to punt. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose! Unless you're in a sleeping contest. And it's first and ten. And the defense falls for that trick all the time. <laughs> now they're mopping the players off the field. Literally. I will kill those Second down and ten. Don't you just 
love the sound of bones snapping and cracking. I mean, when they're not yawn. And that'll bring up third and one. like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and 10. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First down and seven. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a wipe for the headache. And that'll be second down. Only two minutes left in the game. And that'll be second down and four. The defense calls timeout. They must be trying to get on their QB's good side. Third down and eight. And nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. How have they not killed him yet? He's wearing a new mink coat, for God's sake. He's seven layers of smarmy grin. <laughs> Third down and, and the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. The defense has to make something happen here with one timeout left. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm, that's bleak, Bricks. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And that's a sack. The quarterback has to get rid of the ball there. Hey, timeouts are kind of like condoms, you know, Grim? You got to use them smart if you want to score. Let's see if they did. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Oh, it's a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. The 
that receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for 10 yards. Third down and a sliver. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Man, he's dancing like a zonked out jam band enthusiast. Oh, that's how he spends his entire offseason. They're going for two points. And they run it in for two points. <laughs> Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. They'll both electrify the opposition and come away with a victory. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because I tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the scotch, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. Yeah, man, I was hitting on the now. You know what Brim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Eagle SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...